Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will be talking about a very beautiful plant called Gladiolus. You must have seen this plant in decorations and in flower bouquets. They are extremely popular as cut flowers and they are great plant for your garden. We grow them here during our winter spring season. They come in lots of colors and they add so much variety in the garden with their dramatic and vibrant flowers that grow in a long stick. I will discuss how to grow them, so stay tuned and don't forget to like and subscribe to stay connected. These plants grow from corms or you can call them bulbs. This is how the bulbs look like. You can get bulbs from your local nursery or you can order online. Whenever you buy them, make sure you have a good quality large bulb. Bigger the size, better the flower. You can see the suits are already coming out. Some of them have two shoots, which is great. Here I have taken a flat container with plain compost. Before planting them directly in the final pot, I will be placing them in compost so they can develop some roots and grow a little. After that, I will be planting them in my final container. You can place them on sand or just compost, both will be fine. You can keep them for 7 to 10 days like that. After that, you can repot them. You can see after a few days, they have grown quite a bit. I will be planting them in this plastic bag. You can see they have developed nice roots now. If you want to plant 4 or 5 bulbs together, choose at least a 10 to 12 inch container so they can get enough space to grow well. Plant them at least 3 inches deep so they can grow strong and don't flop over by the wind. Gladiolus grow best in rich well draining soil. Don't choose a very heavy clay soil for them. That can damage the bulbs. You can mix 30% good quality compost, some river sand, add a tablespoon of bone meal and neem cake powder. They will grow quite well even if you don't fertilize them. You can add any organic liquid fertilizer weekly for growth and that will be enough. You can grow them in full sunlight or in partial shade. Try to give them at least 5 to 6 hours of direct sunlight for better flowers. Water only when the soil feels dry. Don't overwater them that can damage the plants. Make sure you have a good drainage system. Around 90 days, your plant will start to flower. They flower for a short time, but they are definitely worth it. You can save the bulbs after the plant dies. They are quite easy to grow, so definitely grow them in your garden. I hope this video was helpful. Do share your thoughts in the comment section and don't forget to like and subscribe. I will see you next time. Bye!